Okay, it's Friday. Welcome, and who's ready for Friday? I'm Robin, me, let's get to there. Here's what's going on. Slam the president's decision to pull out of the deal. In a statement, France, Germany, and advisor to the Trump campaign disagrees, obviously, and says that it's selfish to deny developing countries the chance to use energy to succeed. Process of actually leaving the deal actually will take years, did you know? And would not wrap up until 2020. Happens to be the same month that President Trump would be up for re-election. So it's not just politicians criticizing the president's decision. Top CEOs are also saying that he's on the wrong path. That angle still to come in about 10 minutes here. You know, hundreds of people scramble to get out after police in the Philippines say a robber ambushed a resort, shooting and setting off explosives. Good morning. Our salute to the troops today is from a mom and a daughter. They want to salute the service men in their family. Howdy. Word? Peeping? My hair just stood on fire. Right? And okay, now it's back. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. Uh, Google reportedly says that it is going to make the Internet a lot less annoying. Okay. <laughs> yeah. With a new kind of ad filter about how many times it's going to ask me, <laughs> would you like to remove this cookie? Good morning. Now I want an ad to just <laughs> pop up right over us for a second and annoy you all. Because we're talking about, no. Yeah, the worst ads, the most annoying, like maybe they pop up, maybe they start playing their own sound, maybe there's flashing lights, or you know when you can't even find, you're trying to turn it off, you can't even find the Yeah, or it takes you. And I'm like, I don't know where you came from, but thank you. <laughs> Is it, I wonder if it's the same type of deal. Like, you're not well, like is this an extra job and on your way home from work, you've got my package? I don't know. Well, do you mean they work at an Amazon warehouse or they are Amazon deliverers? I don't know because they don't have anything on their car sometimes. The, the yeah, notes no, are on Amazon. Too. They're not supposed to. People just show up and they bring me stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I wish. All right. <laughs> Jen, thank you. Good morning, Robin. Good morning, Jen. How exciting is this? So many people cannot wait for this movie. In fact, I know two people who've already seen it, and they're in the studio right now. Not only could this re this movie make Gal Gadot a household name, but unlike Marvel, Warner Brothers needs it to break their superhero jinx. So you remember the recent Superman movies and Suicide Squad? Well, most critics hated those. And this is the first time a woman has directed a big budget action movie. Patty Jenkins is the director, and people are already saying she needs That is, that's a bunch of humble pie. <laughs> Pizza pie. <laughs> All right, in our next hour, an opiate bust in Utah gets half hour now. You know, a tornado slammed into an elementary school while students and teachers were in 30 minutes past the hour. I'm Robin Mead. Thank you so much for having us start your day. Well, I know coffee does as well. News in the fast lane, let's hit that. So President Trump has asked the Supreme Court to reinstate his executive order regarding travel. Remember, lower courts have ruled that it's unconstitutional. The temporary ban would block people from six, mostly Muslim countries, from entering the United States. Well, the case could be heard before the Supreme Court's recess. That comes this month. Uh, nearly a dozen drivers had to be rescued when flash flooding trapped them in their cars in Corpus Christi, Texas. The storms dumped up to four inches of rain across the city yesterday. Thankfully, nobody's injured. A brand new Wonder Woman is out today. Can you believe this is 75 years in the making? Now, it stars Gal Gadot, Gadot as the warrior princess and Chris Pine as her spy sidekick. All right, so riding a wave of mostly positive reviews. Was it good or not? Well, experts predict that it could have a $100 million weekend. So the reviews are good anyway. See what you think. France's President Emmanuel Macron slammed President Trump for pulling out of the Paris Climate Agreement and invited U.S. scientists and engineers to come continue their work in France. I don't even know who this celebrity is, and I can't wait to My see it. My own siblings. I was not allowed to tell anybody. Oh, My own it. siblings don't even know. Be tuning in yeah. for that. Ah, I, can't wait to, <laughs> I can't wait to go. I would love to ask that celebrity, too. Like, what do you think? <laughs> now, it's not Rihanna, but Rihanna seemed to go head-to-head -head with Kevin Durant, all right, in the middle <laughs> oh, of goodness. the NBA Finals. 
Don't ask Kevin about it. Yeah, it would make sense if it was Rihanna because she can sing and you can sing and that was, that, I can see that. <laughs> but yes, this was uh, an unexpected rivalry <laughs> boiling up from this this get, this matchup, this NBA Finals. She was sitting courtside. Read that one, that one was so bad. <laughs> I'll go back and try to find that one. <laughs> All right, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> All right, Google is rolling out a new feature that can make the internet surfing a little less annoying for you when it comes to ads. Any context? Minutes ago, the Labor Department released how many jobs the economy created in May. That's one thing, but then the unemployment rate looks great. Okay, now where do we see the jobs being yeah. created? Jen's got that, good morning. Good morning, and here's your context. It was kind of lousy. If you wake up and you're expecting a bright sunny day and it's a little bit overcast, it's not that bad. But you were expecting something different. Good and way to look at that's it. what happened here. There was a lot of hope this was gonna be a big today, 75 years in the making, and people are saying this they hope it does well at the box office. And why are they saying that? Because um, they need a hit, and we need a summer blockbuster. That's why, Robin, good morning to you. Good morning, Jen. And besides and, that, it's and a, I need Wonder Woman to do Exactly. Ah. It's, it's a heroine, and we don't want exactly, her to Exactly, yeah. exactly. And not only could this movie make Gal Gadot a household name, but unlike Marvel, Warner Brothers needs it to break their superhero jinx. Because you remember the recent Superman movies, and so you're rooting for this yourself because... Remember, we turned you into Wonder Woman. Look There's an inner Wonder Woman in all of us. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. You really <laughs> pulled that off. You nailed it, actually. In the This Exists file, there's a whole big tape that includes all of us. That on the was internet so fun. Somewhere. That was a lot of fun. Yeah. I enjoyed it. So that's out today, for yes, real. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Also trending, the Foo Fighters look like they aged a few decades in their new music video for Run. Look at this. But that, that was. People are going to remember that video, yes, right? That is a good one. All right. So a scary moment for passengers on a United Airlines flight after a bird struck an engine moment on the last day of school. Let's take you there. Melissa Knowles with the tape. Good morning. Good morning, ladies. This is like a hashtag all the feels because people got teary-eyed. They were emotional over this picture of a girl from Texas with her dad. Also trending this morning, strangers on a train race to find a murderer after a murder on the Orient Express. Look. 